Hey everybody, Mike Brugger here. I want to introduce you to a concept that I've been working on for the past several years. It's something that will absolutely increase your mentalism game by a thousand percent. In the past, a lot of mentalism activities, well, with cards especially, have been done using these uh, these images that are very familiar to magicians and uh, not as familiar to the public and the lay people. These are the so-called Xenar cards. Uh, and um, when uh, mentalists do use these as part of a discussion, they have to spend the first several minutes explaining what they are, where they came from, Dr. Ryan, Duke University, etc., etc. End of the day, nobody remembers these things because they're just images, right? They're symbols that have no meaning whatsoever. Uh, and consequently, people actually forget the effects that you're using them for, which is a shame because there's a lot of really good effects out there that use the, uh, the standard ESP. So what I did is to reinvent the whole concept of the ESP deck. What I've come up with is something that I call the Emotional Sensitivity Perception ESP. Get it? Uh, emotional Sensitivity Perception Deck. And it's wrapped in this project that I call the Emotional Sensitivity Project. So instead of having uh, the typical Xenar symbol cards, I've got emotions. Things that people can really relate to. Joy, fear, and anger, and being mellow and calm and, and sad. And uh, behind each of the, uh, the words on these, you'll see uh, little, little symbols. Uh, I actually, I've got the symbols uh, printed on the, oops, upside down, the symbols printed on the cards uh, themselves. So uh, what you get with the ESP perception, or rather the uh, emotional sensory perception project, what you get in the deck, uh, you, you'll you get five sets of five each of these cards, just like an ESP set, plus you'll get an additional five sets of the uh, emotional sensitivity perception cards without the words on it, just the symbols. Plus you'll get a couple of extra special cards along the way. And uh, did I mention that the backs of the cards are marked? So uh, just like a good set of uh, standard uh, ESP Zenner cards being marked, these two are marked on the back. So really, anything that you've done in the past with your traditional ESP cards, you can do with the new, uh, with the, these new emotional sensitivity perception cards. Except this time, they're, you're dealing with emotions. You're not dealing with abstract symbols. You're dealing with emotions. This is stuff that people can relate to because they can relate to it and requires really no explanation in the beginning because they can relate to it automatically you're going to have a tremendous increase in how your effects are appreciated and understood and, and, and the strength and the power of these effects so that is the uh, emotional sensitivity perception deck the espd part of the Emotional Sensitivity Project. And in addition to the deck of all those cards, you get a book that's uh, 60 plus pages uh, that you'll download that have uh, detailed explanations and lots of good tricks and uh, a few references and some uh, other cool things that you can take a look at and things that you can do with the uh, with this deck. Hope you enjoy it and I uh, hope you buy it.